Well, hello there, everybody. Dre here, and welcome back to the weirdest supermarket this side of the roadway. Today, we're back out in Supermarket Simulator, and things are going well. Why is there water on the floor? My stalker is clearly not doing his job very well. Anyways, welcome back to my office. If you missed the last episode, you might have some questions, and I'm not going to answer them because I'm way too lazy. So, yes, today we're going to get out once again. Oh, it looks like... um. <laughs> My cashier that got stuck on the street, I, I, I guess he got fixed. And now he's he's perfectly placed, as you can see. I think I'm just going to keep him there to see what happens because I'm morbidly curious at this point. All right, so big goals today. We really got to expand out this place. There's not much room because of my massive office. So I really would like to um, expand out. We're actually going to waste no time and start purchasing some more of these licenses. I want to catch up to my store level, so we have three more we can technically buy right now. We really got to keep up with that. Oh, exciting. We got a mirrored checkout counter now. That's actually pretty cool um, because you can set up your stores in many different ways now. Uh, I'm going to buy, I think, two shelving units right now. We're obviously going to change the store back. The whole maze idea was just a joke. But I kind of like it for right now, so we'll, we'll, we'll keep it for the time being. So I have to restock these new items, and then we'll open our store once I uh, restock everything here. Where the hell is my... Oh, I don't want this. I don't want this. Oh, God. Why do I have so much freaking cleaner? Oh, this guy clearly needs cleaner. Okay. Um, I forgot I have to put everything down here. We're doing pretty good for stock, though, as you can see. I have pretty much everything stocked in here. All right, well, I'm broke once again, but we have lots of stock for my generic items. I'm just, I'm getting overwhelmed with the amount of items. So every shelf is a different item now. I, as you can see, I've had to place things in weird spots right now. We will redesign this. I just want to open up shop today uh, so we can start earning some money because, uh, yeah, I'm going to need some money to expand out this place. And I'd like to expand it out before I upgrade it, preferably. So, hopefully the customers can cash out. I truly have no idea if that will work or not. Um, there's a cashier here if I need to use it. <laughs> it works! It actually... Wait, what are you buying? Oh, wait, that's the shelf I thought she bought. <laughs> like, so many of these spray bottles. How are you actually getting in the line, though? I'm so confused. Because he's right here. This is like the back rooms of the supermarket right now. What the hell? I don't know how that one checked out. Can anyone else check out? So did, did they just go right through the wall? All right, buy some rice. I just want to see what happens here. Okay. And she's buying some of the spray bottles. Wait, where did you come from, sir? How did you get... Okay, so do you go in here? I don't know how they're getting here. I'm trying to figure it out. Yep. Yep. And right through. So they break all the laws of physics to get here. That's great. Okay. All right. Now that we've answered that question let's actually uh pull this back here so it kind of makes a little more sense and uh yeah i'm gonna slowly redesign the store once i start restocking everything i want to make sure i don't run out of stock of anything oh i haven't set up the prices either damn it what is in this sugar how is this 12 dollars? that's one of my most pricey items it's just a thing of sugar where are you getting these prices now honey should be expensive right okay that's more acceptable but just a, a freaking thing of sugar is 12 dollars Please buy my Pablo sugar, everybody. Okay, I think we really need to redesign the store to fit the other cashier. Um, having some demand issues, as you can clearly see. Good problem to have. Uh, didn't expect it to be this high of demand this early. So uh, we'll definitely do that tomorrow. I was just trying to buy stock for everything. Actually, I need about 440. So let's see. Can I buy that? I need 479. All right, so we'll finish the day. See how many customers products found expensive okay so i gotta figure out that i wish it told me how many complained about uh the checkouts being filled because there was quite a bit uh so yeah i guess damn it okay so milk is one up the six pack six pack of milk wait what are you talking about i don't even know what that is six pack of milk ah found the expensive item okay so that good that's good that makes me happy all right and i guess we'll just open the store because we gotta sell some of this oh there's the milk right there okay i found it right at the end it was right at my front uh, so we'll change that price as well. So all my pricing should be good. Now I just need to earn some money so I can restock some of my low stock. Like we are out of this cereal right now. Uh, okay. What's going on now? Everyone's saying the checkouts are filled. Look, it's empty guys. <gasps> oh, why can't I place this now? Why? Oh God. Oh God. How did it break? I didn't do anything. I literally did nothing this time. Oh no. Oh, no, this... Okay, I went on my computer. Um, oh, this is real bad. This is... 
Um, hold on, everybody. I can't. I can't do anything. Wait, I think I just placed it. Okay, I did. Oh, today's gonna be a real bad day. Okay, we're gonna have to redesign the store. I feel like my whole store setup is just glitching it or something. I mean, I can't even use it. I can't grab it now, so I'm gonna have to reload the game. I think. I, th I, I think I somehow broke it again. Okay, he's back. He's inside a shelf now. What is this? I guess my stalker was doing this when I reloaded. Um, that, that's not, what? That's not supposed to be there, game. Stalker? I might have to fire you. Yeah, yeah, you just came to fill it? And it's, uh, that's a pro, how do I, oh. <laughs> no! God damn it! I don't want to throw this out either because these things are not cheap. Uh, that's never happened. Anyways, I guess I could update you guys now. I have been restocking the store. Oh, for 40 minutes at least? I thought it'd be fun to restock fully the store. It, it is not fun. I, I'm losing my mind, but we're almost done as you can see. Uh, stocking's going well. I've also expanded out my stocking area. And would you look at that? We have at, well, we kind of have access. I, 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 can, I can kind of peek on my guy. So, I need to rearrange my store now more than ever because obviously I would like to uh, utilize that door. I just was really hoping to expand out the store before I rearrange it. Problem is, it's going to take me about, I think, six grand to do that because I want to expand not once but twice. And that is because it's going to re square off the store. It does only uh, a corner of the store, at least it has been doing that. So I'd like to purchase both of these at the same time and then finally, you know, rearrange the store to the point where it actually makes sense. Problem is, I just spent six, seven grand restocking the store. I do have eggs. They just have to come. I'm, w I'm waiting for him. So I'm broke again. Well, not really broke. I actually have quite a bit of money. So I guess we'll open up. And now we don't have to worry about stocking anytime soon because everything has been fully stocked. I'm assuming this guy's coming with the eggs now. Yes, thank you very much. And I also did fill up my storage quite a bit for certain items that are very easy to stock. Like, for example, I have 157 salt, 108 of these eggs that he's stocking right now. So I have been trying to uh, add stock to my storage as well. So it's not just simply boxes in here. There is actually a bit of strategy. So yeah, not really sure if it was worth the effort, but very rarely we get to appreciate a fully stocked store. And uh, well, it's going to be stocked for the time being, but it's probably not going to last too much longer. All right, now I got to earn some money so we can uh, expand out this place. Hey, buddy, there you go. I just kind of let him creep through so he stocks even faster. Wow, somebody bought, people already bought rice. Nice. Don't go into my store. Yeah, that's actually, that's not too bad. That works for right now. All right, I had to turn my office into the second cashier to deal with demand. Um, Wait, did you give me something? I can't even see you. Uh, Where are you? This is, this is totally broken. I, I, I'm giving zero. Where? Where, where, how do I give zero? Is there a button I'm forgetting how to do? It's been a while since I last did this. I would like this order. It's $107, but uh, I guess I'm just gonna have to finish the day. <laughs> Only 16 customers. Yeah, I think I really need to redesign this store. Well, that is officially my biggest order yet. $137, not bad at all. I fired my uh, cashier because he kept breaking. Literally every day he breaks. Uh, he's also very slow, so instead of having two counters, uh, I figured I'd just do the dirty work for right now until we get about six grand, which shouldn't take too long, considering the price of these orders that we're getting now. And this will be another big one with three clean dishes. That is going to be fantastic. 102, nice. Oh my god, it's the clean dish day. How much is that one? 93? Oh man, I actually kind of miss this. It gets annoying after a while, but it, it is super satisfying to see how quickly this money can come in. And we just hit level 20. That is a huge level. That means we are going to be able to do it, or we're going to be able to hire two cashiers. If they work, of course. That was a big goal of mine for this store expansion. So now we're going to have two employees. And I would say that is a legit supermarket now. If you have two cashiers, you are a supermarket in my opinion. So, uh, yeah, once we get this money, we will be... Um, adding that second employee as well. Where where you go? Oh, okay. You have to go over there to get that. Okay. All right. That's it for the day. Let's see how we did with us at the counter. Actually, not a lot better than him. Some days he only does like 16, but on, on his good days, he does like high 20. So I'm really not that much faster. All right. We may as well buy the first upgrade just to see where this is going to expand out to. I'm very curious about that. Uh, oh, Okay, I didn't actually expect that. So we got that small room over here. So we might need to expand not once, but three times to do the whole wall. I thought it was only two. 
damn it all right my stock isn't so hot but as you can see we should have enough money now to finally do the upgrade i've wanted to do since the start of this episode so we can get rid of this stupid stored layout idea that i had so i think it was four thousand and something yeah four thousand four hundred i can't even upgrade the store more if i wanted to so this is as big as we can get it and yeah, we just have this dumb corner over here. So we're probably going to use this back area as our cash out area for the time being. All right, and let's finally redesign this because I'm getting really annoyed with this dumb layout that I did. Okay, so I bought the mirrored checkout. So we should, yes, look at that. That looks so much better. Have one on each side. I have a lot more room than I expected. Go figure, when you set up your store dumb like that, uh, you don't realize the space that you have. So we have lots of space to expand, as you can see. Added the generic lanes for right now. I might change this later. Uh, but now we have some nice long laneways for hopefully queues. And I just stored my office. I guess you would call it an office in the back. So yeah, I like this layout. I wish I could put something on the walls or something. Uh, but yeah, this should be much better. And we have room for expansion as we do get more uh, groceries. So we'll open up and I got to earn some money here so we can restock. We're not doing awful for the stock, but I would like to try and keep ahead of it. This guy has been stocking this whole time I rearranged the store. That's how much he has to do. Uh, oh, I should also maybe hire uh, some employees. That would be smart. Not one, but two this time. How exciting. All right, so hire and are they the same price? Yeah, they're the same price. So it's thankfully very cheap to hire people in this game and they should be working right away. Look at them. Look how happy they are staring at each other. <laughs> in an actual store with a, you know, a somewhat grocery store layout. I can easily see everything by quick glance. This is much better. I definitely need uh, some oil and a penne right now. As well as spaghetti. So anything Italian basically I need, I guess. All right, I'm very curious to see, though, if these guys will be able to keep up with demand. Uh, with one, obviously, it was nowhere near enough because these guys are not very fast. But with two, I got to assume this should be good. So we'll see how they do today. All right, safe to say we have similar demand. But yeah, they are keeping up just fine, as you can see, with said demand. So oh, I'm so excited to earn some serious cash in this game. And the great thing is all I have to do now is pay attention. Why is he not stocking my penne? Did I forget to buy it? I, pr I probably did. To be fair, he's very busy, though. It's a little dark back there. Do you guys want some lights, or do you appreciate the romantic lighting? Yeah, I gotta remember, I need to buy more of these damn lights. Man, we're already over $1,000, though. Can I buy lights? I wonder if I can buy lights for in here. I probably can. Okay, I might have spent a grand on lights. I just didn't want to have to keep buying one of these every time I expand out the store. So we have a very bright entrance and then a seemingly normal uh, place, more or less. Uh, we can definitely move some of these around, though. I just didn't want to have to store them. There's no sense storing lights if I can just use them whenever I want. All right, and the final customer of the day looks to be a bit of a doozy here. And this guy works at uh, the pace of molasses. So uh, I'll just let him cash out here. She looks dead inside as she waits. But yeah, I'm curious to see how many customers we indeed did serve today. Uh, from what I've seen, there was no more than two in a line. So yeah, we should be totally fine for demand for a long while with just two cashiers. And there we go, the final one. How did we do? 39 customers. So a good day was like 31 for me. So we're definitely doing much better. Nice profit of negative uh, $4,000 because I spent way too much on lighting and a few other things. But uh, yeah, it looks like my store is finally turning into somewhat of a supermarket. Oh, great. There's just a bunch of things that are down today. So yeah, we might be struggling for some profits for the time being. But yeah, I really enjoy this game. I don't know. It's super simple, but it is super satisfying to see your store slowly expand out. And yeah, we're getting to the point where we're earning some serious money. So hopefully in the next few episodes, we can do the, exactly that. Because yeah, we're starting to get to the point where growth is going to be very, very expensive. Like some of these are over a million dollars. It's actually insane. But yeah, if you guys enjoy this, let me know in the comments below. There should be an update sooner or later. I'm really hoping we can get some sort of stock checker uh, employee or even like a computer or something. Because uh, that would be my one complaint. You have to visually see everything. And as we expand out, it's going to get more and more crazy. But yeah, if you guys enjoy it, let me know in the comments below. And yeah, as always, thanks for watching and liking, guys. I'll see you in the next one. Hey there. Before you go, I just wanted to let you know about my second channel, Gast. If you're missing my multiplayer shenanigans, then please consider checking it out. Scan the QR code or copy the link down below. Okay, bye. Captain! It's too bizarre. Why am I bizarre? What's wrong? That face is too... It's it's too messy. Here, put the smiler on. Somebody show him. Up here. Oh my God. No, I'm keeping it.